Most of us are aware that polluted air can harm our lungs and cardiovascular system. However, many are not aware that it can also negatively impact our bones and joints. When we inhale polluted air, tiny particles and toxins enter our bloodstream. They don't just remain in the lungs, they spread throughout our bodies. Over time, this exposure can lead to a condition known as chronic inflammation. This type of inflammation gradually weakens our bones and joints. What's even more concerning is that ongoing inflammation can accelerate the onset of arthritis, increase the risk of fractures and hinder recovery after bone or joint surgeries. You may wonder how does this happen? When our bodies are constantly trying to combat inflammation caused by these pollutants, they divert all their resources away from crucial healing processes, making it harder for the bones and joints to repair by themselves. Additionally, air pollution can also reduce the amount of sunlight that reaches us, which is essential for our bodies to produce vitamin D. We all know that vitamin D is a very, very important vitamin which plays a vital role in maintaining bone health. And without enough vitamin D, our bones can lose density, strength and make them more susceptible to fractures. In my experience, I have observed that those who live in areas with high pollution levels often take longer to heal from injuries. Their bodies have to work extra hard to fight off the inflammation caused by this poor air quality, which can delay effective recovery. Moreover, when the air quality worsens, many people tend to avoid outdoor activities like walking or jogging or exercising. This can lead to stiffness in our joints, potential weight gain and increased joint pain. The good news is that there are steps we can take to mitigate these effects. On the days when the air quality is less than ideal, think about maintaining your activity levels indoors, whether it's doing yoga or workout or simply just moving around the house. Staying active is essential for your joints and overall health. Another important strategy you need to focus on is your diet. Eating foods rich in calcium like dairy products, leafy green vegetables and fortified foods can help strengthen your bones. Don't forget to monitor your vitamin D levels too. If you need to go outside when the air quality is compromised, wearing a high quality mask can help you minimize the exposure to these pollutants. Ultimately, the air that we breathe affects not just our physical health, but also how we move, live and feel on a daily basis. Let's take proactive steps to improve air quality and protect our overall well-being. Thank you for listening.